and it's silent. And silent in the studio is, is a big plus. These words are valuable, they're special, heavy with them. I know I said no more M1 MacBook testing, but there's new stuff I found out. A couple of people told me in the comments that if you go into Logic and you set in the audio settings the um, threads from automatic to eight, because this one has eight cores, it boosts the performance by a lot. And it actually does. I'm wondering why it's not set by default like that. I can now run, instead of nine instances of D.Va, I can run 18. That's a huge bump and actually makes it really close to my MacBook 16 inch fully spec 2019 version. This one right here handles 21 and the MacBook Air 18. That's not a big difference. That's that's now I'm really amazed because this thing right here still has to transcode logic through Rosetta. Now we're talking. This is impressive. It's so impressive. I'm actually closing this one right here, putting it aside. And I will use for the entire next week, this one right here. I will keep you updated. I will use it one week exclusively, just this thing and see if I can make all of my music with it, all of my video editing, everything else, and then give you an update. But like so far, if it's like 18 versus 21 instances of D.Va before they crap out, that's close enough. I mean, I still prefer the form factor and it's silent. And silent in the studio is, is a big plus. <laughs> my job. I'm just sitting here making music. I employ two people, they come here, I sign something and they take care of it. That's, that's really amazing. The only thing that is even more amazing is this little machine. Full session, no problem, no hiccup. I even repeated the serum test with this new setting and it actually was able to beat the other machine by quite a lot. It was 417 instances, layers of serum, versus 310. It is faster in certain tasks, which I, I still can't believe. That, that's it, I'm convinced. This is now my new computer. I just need to install like the, the second monitor again here because the screen is really a little too small for like logic, full project, but the speed is there. Ultra compact, no, fa I, like I, I can't believe it. That's like the biggest jump in processing power I've ever experienced. Amazing. Like now, I can recommend it fully, 100%. If you need a new computer, get one of the M1 machines, save a ton of money, MacBook Air, fully enough for music production. I'm actually really doing it, using the time tonight to transfer all of my private data, making sure everything is on here. And I also wanted to let you know that there are still all of the Black Friday sales. So first link in the description, just go check it out. Perfect time to buy any kind of music plugin. Most of them are 50 or even 70% reduced in price. Most of the Isotope stuff, Aturia stuff, um, Sound Toys, Fab Filter, like all of them, they're having big sales. And we're still daily updating that list so that you're all informed who has the best deals, what kind of plugin you don't have, you can still get. And also my sample pack Elements 8 is on a special sale for Black Friday. Just five bucks for the new sample pack, plus all of the old sample packs included. And it has like a bunch of guitar samples, original recorded with effects, without effects, a lot of drum samples, plus all of the old ones. Some of them even contain like entire logic projects of my music where you can just use it as a basis to work on. And the very last thing I wanted to remind you is to submit your remixes. As you know, we started a remix competition a couple of months ago. It's ending very, very soon. You should be by now almost finished with it and start submitting it. We will announce the winners with all of those huge prizes 
probably, let me check, in 10 days. So definitely tune in. We'll see us tomorrow back again in the studio. I will now just sit here and transfer everything.